Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and it's Deb C and pleased to be, it's Deb C. Boop, boop, that's me. Boop, Deb C. Hey guys and happy Tuesday. I hope everybody is having a great week so far. And just remember, if you are not at any time during the day, you can always restart your day. Listen, um, yesterday I restarted it several times. So just remember that. Okay, so if it's six o'clock in the morning, which it is when you're watching this, then you know that it's what? It is Motivational Mornings with me, me, Deb C. Bloop. Okay, so let's get into it with a quote. There's five rules of happiness. Don't hate, don't worry, give more, expect less, and live simply. That is, that is very, very poignant, good um, advice, especially in these days. Okay, so, and, and it's not attributed to anybody, so I don't know who said it, who the quote's from. Um, okay, so in pop culture history in this day, in 1943, the first Batman movie premiered with, I've never heard of these people, with Lewis Wilson as the Cape Crusader and Douglas Craft as his sidekick, Robin. Um, the first parking meter was installed in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma in 1935. Here are a couple. Um, oh, wait a minute, wait. Also, in pop culture history, Hocus Pocus, the movie, the iconic Hocus Pocus was released and it premiered in 19, 1993. Listen, my chat with my good Judy's and my Vlogarina Vlog Squad, that is like, has to be the favorite, the um, chat favorite in all of the land. I'm, that's what I'm thinking. In the comments below, if any of you guys are watching, meaning Kristen or Emily or Rissa or Bunny or Koe, let me know. Am I right? Is it one of the chat favorites? That's Hocus Pocus. I think it is. Um, okay, getting into the facts. Um, flamingos are, are pink. We all know that, but they're pink and that's because of the high amounts of beta carotene in their diets. Also, <clears throat> Mark Twain was the first author to use a typewriter to write a manuscript. So there we go. In celebrity birthdays, I was only able to find a couple. Um, born in 1963 and turning 61 today is Phoebe Cates. You know Phoebe Cates from um, Fast Times at Ridgemont High. I also, um, listen, I was wondering, is she still married to Kevin Klein? And she is, that's awesome. I love when I see couples that are just still married and have been married in Hollywood for like decades upon decades, because that doesn't seem to be the norm. I love seeing that. But here's a little, um, here is a little fact about Phoebe Cates. Phoebe Cates was actually supposed to play Steve Martin's, I almost said Steve Miller's, Steve Martin's daughter in Father of the Bride. So that was to be her role, but she had to drop out because she was pregnant with her first child. So there we go. In Born in 1967 is Will Ferrell. He is 57 today. And he, I did not know this, but he is part of what's known as the Frat Pack. Not the Rat Pack or the Brat Pack, but the Frat Pack. And this is made up of guys who, um, who are friends and who appeared in movies together. And that was like Ben Stiller, Vince Vaughn, Steve Carell, the Owen, or the Owen brothers, which is um, Owen Wilson and Luke Wilson, and my number one dream, my wonder, number one dream lover, <gasps> Paul Rudd. Mm, okay, so there we go. And also born in 1971, turning 53, gosh, I am old, is Corey Feldman. Now listen, I didn't come, I did see a bunch of stuff on Corey Feldman, but I want to keep it, I don't want to get like, it was all a lot of heavy stuff. But I do remember 
whenever years ago, it was in 2019, and I went to the Comic Con in Monroeville, PA. And is that a spam? It's a spam number. There's like a, I'm getting a call and there's a spam number. It says spam risk right over there. That's why I'm looking at it. Go, it went. And um, it was in 2019 and I went down because I went to it, I attended because um, I wanted to meet and I did get to meet some of the cast members of The Office, which if you don't know, The Office is my all time favorite TV show of all time. Um, but one of the people that was there was Corey Feldman and we had to kill some time. So we sat in on his um, Q and A. And he did say that they had, there was him and the other Corey, Corey Haim, they did license to drive, but then there was, was there another part to it? He said that there was actually supposed to be like a trilogy of, of these like license to movies and that never came to fruition. Yeah. Um, okay, so there we go. That is everything for Motivational Mornings. <gasps> we're wrapping this up. We're wrapping this up. I'm actually filming this on Monday. So I'm wrapping it up pretty nicely. And I'm going to get into The Bachelorette, which you are going to see the wrap up of that later on today. Later on today. So listen, um, if nobody told you yet today, oh, potatoes downstairs, potato would tell you, you can do this. But listen, if nobody told you yet today, I love you. Your love seen and heard. Please make sure that you put love, kindness, compassion, acceptance, hope, and positivity and understanding out there. So that it comes right back at you. Please, um, take care of one another. Please, let's... Let's be civil. Let's at least be civil one another. Um, and three things I always say. Number one, please be aware of your surroundings. Number two, please stay safe. Number three, if you're somewhere that it is like ridiculously hot, please um, don't go out if you don't have to. But if you have to and you want or you want to, then just hydrate and hydrate often and stay cool. And don't push it. Push it real good. I'm gonna take you out on a dance. Push it. Push it real good. Okay. All right, guys. I will see you later. Everybody have a great day. Now you can do it. Bye, guys.